Are you living the life you've always wanted to live? Have you chased your dreams through thick and thin until they became reality? Now, I'm not saying that in this game all your dreams will come true, but I am saying that in this game you can join a sweet motorcycle gang while owning a boat and a rapidly growing vintage coin collection. In the Pursuit of Happiness, designed by David Chirkop, Adrian Abella, and Vangelis Bagiotakis, and published by Artipia Games, you get to live the life you've always dreamed. Or your worst nightmare. It's really up to you. Hi everybody, my name is Nick Murphy of the Brothers Murph and we are here with Board Game Geek and today's In Focus is sponsored by the Board Game Geek store. So, it's time to make our dreams a reality, so let's get this game down to the table while we go a little In Focus on the Pursuit of Happiness. The Pursuit of Happiness is a worker placement time management game. The workers in this game are hourglasses and every choice you make is you spending just a little more of your time here on Earth. Because, spoiler alert, you will die at the end of this game. You will start off the game as a teen and work through your adulthood and eventually through old age, trying to gain as much long-term happiness, which are points in this game, as you can. But as you go, you need to make sure you gain knowledge, creativity, and influence as they will be needed in your various jobs, projects, activities, and relationships. Using your time and resources on projects seems like a healthy thing to do. A player will need to activate their project multiple times to advance until its final stage, and each project will require you to spend your creativity, influence, or your knowledge. You want to do more activities, but to do so you need some money, so it's time to get a job. You will always have to start at a level 1 job, but don't worry, if you work hard and spend resources you can get promoted. But as you commit more of your life to your career, more and more of your time slips away. But it's okay because now we have some money, so let's start some wild and irresponsible activities. You can go and spend your newfound money on some items and activities. Activities, like projects, have stages you can work through, each level costing more money. For instance, if you start a sweet board game collection, you begin with just a shelf, but if you spend time and money collecting, you can advance to a whole room. You've got it all, projects, items, and a great job. Maybe it's time to start settling down. As you dive into the dating world, you find that each potential partner has things that they're looking for. Some want you to be creative, others want you to be smart, and others are all about that money. And each relationship card has identical male and female sides. But like careers, the deeper you get into a relationship, the more time it takes, leaving you less time for activities and projects. But who says you have to be in a relationship or have a job? Maybe you want to be in several relationships or have three jobs. You can live the life you want to live in this game, but be careful because the more reckless you are with your life, the more stress you will accrue. And if you gain enough stress, you will die and your game will be over. You just have to hope you've gained enough long-term happiness to win, even though you died a grisly, stress-filled death. No, Greg, I can't go to your play. I don't have time. Yes, Jenny, I'm dating seven other people, and yes, it is stressful. Living your best life is hard, but in this game, you can really live whatever life you want. You could have three jacuzzis, a boat, and no job. But will that bring you long-term happiness, or will it lead you to an early death? You're gonna have to find out when you play The Pursuit of Happiness. And if The Pursuit of Happiness seems like a game you might enjoy, make sure to check out its page on BoardGameGeek.com and join the discussion. Until next time, I have been Nick Murphy. We've been here with Board Game Geek and we've been going in focus on the pursuit of happiness. Have a great day.